Hey guys, this is just going to be a quick video. I wanted to show you guys this little breakout board that I got for the ESP8266-01 module. I got this little breakout board from a friend and I just wanted to show you guys how it works and how to get it set up and running. So on the computer over here, I have two different Arduino scripts up. One of them is for the ESP module, and the other is for the TNC 2.0 microcontroller that I'm using. And the ESP code, it's really, it's pretty simple. It's pretty similar to a lot of the code that I've shown you guys before. It waits for a signal on the light topic, and in the callback, it when it gets either a 1 or a 0, it instead of turning on or off a light on the ESP module, it actually writes either a one or a zero on its serial line and waits for a ping back from the microcontroller, in this case, the Teensy. And if it gets that ping back, it then publishes to the light confirm topic. So the Teensy node, or the other microcontroller, it's very, very simple. This is all the loop is. It just waits for serial to be av available. When it is, it reads it. If it's a one, it turns on the pin. If it's a zero, it turns off the pin. And it pings back to the ESP. Very simple code, but it, it works. It works well enough to test this unit out. Now, on the hardware, I have the ESP module wired up or just dropped into, rather, this little breakout board, which takes five volt and ground and does all the logic, logic conversion, logic level conversion to 3.3 volts and is, has the TX and RX wired into the TX and RX on the Teensy. So to show you guys how this works, I have my terminal windows here, and on the right side, I have it subscribed to the topic, to the confirmed topic, and on the left side, I have it, and it can publish to the ESP test topic. So if I publish a one, the light turns on, and on the right side screen, we can see it's confirmed that the light is turned on, and if I send it a zero, the light turns off and the ESP module confirms that it's been turned off. So that's all I wanted to show you guys. It's a really nice little board. Again, a friend gave it to me and I'll put a link down in the description for where you can find the schematic for this board and actually buy the board itself. So that's all there is for this video. If you like it, click the like button and definitely subscribe to my channel for more little videos like this. And I'll see you guys later.